Welcome to Trinity School. I do hope that you enjoy this tour. I'm going to be showing you some of our outstanding facilities and talking to you about school life. You'll also hear from some of our staff who play an important part in the lives of our students. Above all, Trinity is a happy school and the size of the community is key to our students feeling happy and valued. We are large enough for a first class teaching staff but small enough that every student is individually known and can play their part. Around a thousand students and 200 staff meet here in the Trinity Concert Hall for assemblies to celebrate every aspect of school life. Relationships between students and their teachers are positive and friendly and this gives us a really relaxed atmosphere. One of my favourite events which took place here in the last couple of years was when Brian May rang and asked the choir to perform a version of Bohemian Rhapsody. At the heart of the school is our library. It's the hub for many academic lessons with excellent resources and IT. And there is always a quiet place to work. Often a hundred or more students will be found here at lunchtime or after school doing homework, researching for a project or just sinking into a beanbag and reading a book. Here's one of the oldest parts of the school. You can see our wide corridors and well-planned spaces. Every student has their own locker and there are forms from different age groups in these classrooms. In a room like this, your son will meet his tutor twice a day. Here's Mr Powell, the head of lower and middle schools. Young people grow and learn best when they feel safe to express themselves and try new and challenging things. At Trinity, we're very proud of our well-founded reputation for excellent pastoral care. At the heart is the support and guidance provided to each student by their tutor and head of year. We deliberately maintain small tutor groups to enable regular meaningful conversations and to make sure that each student is well known. Students can also access counselling or receive support from our nurses. We have class mentors for the lower school and an individual peer mentoring scheme where those who want support with a particular area of school life can be matched with a specially trained sixth form. They had actually two induction days. The first induction day was for the new kids, so not the ones in J-Bugs. And I think that got, I, I already made tons of friends there. Um, so at the Barisha Centre, we did so many different activities from climbing, to gorge walking, to canoeing. And it was such a nice way for everyone to bond together with our new teachers and our new head of year. If you have any problems, she's She's there for you to talk to. She's so nice, always trying to help, always. And she never fails to listen to you and what you are feeling and what you are thinking. We're here to make sure that students set themselves ambitious goals. Our lower and middle school awards programmes are designed to cultivate responsibility, resilience and curiosity to make sure that they're ready for the next step and the one beyond. The success of our pastoral care is down to our commitment to work alongside each student to help them learn and grow. We have three drama and music performance spaces. We want all our students to get involved and feel confident. This is the Mitre Theatre. There's always a range of productions from large ensembles to smaller shows. Drama provides outlets for all our students to take part every year, as well as being taught throughout our curriculum. Here's Mr. Tim, talking about the fantastic range of co-curricular opportunities. Our new boys tell us that one of the things they're most excited about when coming to Trinity is the enormous number of clubs and activities on offer. For many, these will be very new opportunities, and so our job is to introduce them to as wide a range as possible and help them to discover what they find fun and exciting and challenging. For the adventurous, this might be stretching themselves on our climbing wall or down at our activity centre in the Brecon Beacons. It might be on the ground with the cadets or the Duke of Edinburgh scheme or in the air. It might be on the water or under the water with our sub aqua club. It might be exploring your favourite subjects. Every academic department has a club or society attached and it's so important to give bright boys and girls 
every opportunity to pursue their intellectual interest outside the classroom. Whether it's building Daleks, or creative writing, or pottery, or chess, or fencing, there is something to suit everybody. So I think one of the most rewarding things so far at Trinity has been whenever I took part and was the percussionist in the musicals Oliver and Joseph. And the most rewarding thing was working together with the drama department as a big cast and watching it all come together as a really professional play right at the end. All we ask is that our pupils join in and have a go. And perhaps nothing demonstrates that as well as our drama productions, where we aim to combine real excellence along with as many participating as possible. Our new music department sits right at the heart of the school. Well over half of the students at Trinity are actively involved in music every week. There is an opportunity for you no matter what stage you are at. We run groups for beginners in all instruments and singing, all the way up to professional engagements every year for our top choirs, ensembles and orchestras. Here's our Director of Music, David Swinson. I think our big band is brilliant. But there are only 20 students in our big band, and that's why we have three more bands involving a total of 80 students. Music at Trinity is all about inclusion and participation, sharing our enthusiasm and passion for something we absolutely love. Here's our senior orchestra, students of all ages, and it's great to see some of our sixth form girls. Some of these students started to learn the instrument while here. You've heard jazz and classical styles. We encourage all styles because we believe that music is good for you. It fires up your brain, creates social networks, and it's a fabulous skill to take into adult life. We believe everyone can sing. Our boys' choir is invited to sing throughout the world, and our girls have just recorded at the famous Abbey Road Studios. Music should and can be for everyone. At Trinity, it really is. Boys take part in a wide range of sports, including swimming and water polo, squash, badminton and tennis, handball, basketball, dodgeball, as well as our main sports, rugby, hockey, football and cricket. You will have use of our fitness gym and fitness conditioning suite. Or you can try out a new sport, we have a wonderful range of other indoor facilities, including two sports halls, squash courts, and even a TV studio, where students make our regular Trinity news programme and their own films. Trinity is in no sense an exam factory. Being excited by learning and the opportunities in and out of the classroom all lead our students to excellent results. We've always believed that what happens outside the classroom is just as important as what happens within it. As well as our clubs and activities, we find opportunities to take students away from Trinity as often as possible. We run a huge number of trips every year, from day trips to London to visit the theatre or attend lectures, to the more ambitious and exotic. Boys and girls learn so much about themselves and each other when you take them outside of their usual environment. And whether it's Wales, Madrid, or Malawi, we offer something for all interests and all budgets. Here's our dedicated art department and installation space. We have specialist areas for ceramics and sculpture and film editing spaces. Also, four big airy teaching studios and an artist in residence. Here's a taste of our students at work. One of the surprises of our site is just how much outdoor space we have. 27 acres, including two full-sized Astros, hard courts, and world-class grass playing surfaces. Whatever your child's level, or however seriously they take their sport, we have something for every student. Here's our Director of Sport, Ian Kench, talking about our sports ethos and our high performance programme. We want to give all students a lifelong enjoyment of physical activity and sport. 
Whether that be competitive or lifestyle choices, we provide an environment where all can learn and engage. We have an expert coaching staff, of which 13 have represented their country. Most now coach in international teams within the national leagues, junior performance pathways, or in premiership academies. In a recent survey, over half of students representing the school's first teams had no prior experience of that sport before joining the school, a testament to the standard of coaching here. We are proud of our success with our competitive teams. In recent years, 30 have represented their country and over 75 have represented their county. We are in an incredibly fortunate position and we share our expertise. Many of our talented boys and girls come through our bursary programme as a result of our community outreach work. All our sports scholars work within our high performance programme, headed up by London 2012 Olympian Sean King. Students are paired with individual staff mentors, have access to a full-time S&C coach and attend half-termly workshops. We have over 170 teams playing more than 1,000 fixtures each year, with over 700 students representing the school against some of the toughest schools in the country. Whatever your aptitude and ability, you can really achieve something special at Trinity Sport. Above all, we are an academic school. We pride ourselves on our teaching and learning. Our teaching facilities are excellent. Here's our lower school science lab, where year six and seven boys study general science before moving on to study the three sciences separately from year eight in our specialist labs. It's a genuinely inspiring atmosphere for teaching and learning, where superb teachers have the freedom to innovate and support your child as they work towards their GCSE and A-levels. I hope that you enjoyed this brief tour and I do hope that we'll have the pleasure of welcoming you in person soon. Our students are busy and motivated and are by far our best spokespeople. So I'm going to finish up with some comments recorded by them whilst they've been on lockdown enjoying our virtual teaching programme. All I could see were smiling faces of the children and um, teachers. It's quite easy to make friends because it's a very friendly environment. One day I was lost and I asked one of the sixth formers and they helped me, they were really nice. When I joined Trinity, I realised there was nothing to worry about. The teachers are great, the facilities are amazing and the food is delicious. There's so many people to help you, students and teachers alike. They're always willing to give you directions. All of my teachers are very nice and when I have a problem, they always help me and they don't let me give up on myself. You will enjoy your time far in the year, there's loads of opportunities and you will regret it. The relationships with teachers are very positive and if you are struggling with something, they will help you. Trinity is one of the best schools you could ever go to.